I'm uh, Troika Vervaak. I'm the Finance and Accounting Manager of Lyric Business School. Lyric Business School is uh, one of the oldest business schools in Europe. She was founded in 1953 by Professor Vlerik, a renowned academic. The Vlerik Business School is an independent business school with the affiliations with the University of Ghent and the University of Leuven. She has a good tradition of reconciling an academic focus with a business relevance. In that sense, she is really the engine of the management professionalization in Europe. And at this moment, she really goes through an enormous international process. The mission of the school is to contribute to the development of management and entrepreneurship, not only in Belgium, but also in Europe. And she does so by offering high quality executive courses and degree courses on the one hand, and relevant uh, research on the other, on the other hand. We really thought that we needed new systems because we had, made, uh, we had went through a major change process. Our sales really boosted and our people employed were really um, higher the last years. That's why we decided that the old systems were all dated. We had an old accounting system, we had an old CRM system and they could not take us to the next decade. They could no longer support the school's strategy of becoming an international player. That's why we upgraded in a time span of two to three years time our CRM system towards Microsoft Dynamics and our accounting system towards Agresso ERP system. We saw that the capabilities of Coda were limited and that another analytical structure would be better. Better to support the school in her decision making for the future. The scope of the ERP implementation mainly consisted of upgrading the core financial package and enhancing it with real analytical attributes so we could report even more uh, in a detailed manner that we could do with the CODA financial software. This was the main focus, really enhancing financial reporting, analytical reporting, so we could answer all questions of the business managers. Next to that, the focus was also smooth processes uh, and manual interventions um, minimized them. From the beginning, it was clear that we didn't have the resources, nor the capabilities and the experience to embark on such an ERP system and project. So that's why we said, okay, let's do it together with Refinance. They had the experience, they implemented it themselves in a fast-growing organization, and they, it was a good match between culture, between people. So it was easy to decide to go with Refinance as a consulting firm then for our ERP system. Tree Finance, they come in with an open view. They come in with an open view and a lot of experience. Experience in big companies with multiple culture and also with their lessons learned out of previous ERP implementations. We didn't have that. We were a small company, uh, a small medium-sized company with no experience with that. So it took some convincing to see that the way we work is not good for the long run and is not good for companies and continuous change and growth. And how did they convince us? Uh, just by showing at a certain point in an Excel file how a new analytical structure could help us. And this showing in an Excel file actually of how a new structure could look like was an eye-opening for me. Um, Tree Finance challenged us in the design process because they said the analytical key that you use in Coda is all dated and it will not take you where you want in the future. The challenges, it took us some weeks, even months, to really know that what is it all about. But then afterwards, we, we really saw that that old analytical budget key, it really had to be split up, broken down into separate analytical dimensions to be stored into separate fields within the Agresso software. So this was a challenge that the three finance had for us. Get rid of the old thinking and budget number structure and um, make it an analytical structure with uh, data stored in different dimensions. Next to that, an important key learning element was a good project management. Good project management, um, you can't do this between four and five o'clock in the evening. It needs time, resources, planning, replanning, communication with people. And that's how Chief Finance helped us. They helped us with the project management and keeping deadlines in mind. Next to that, you have also the element of um, capacity within your team. Don't think that your team can do this next to their day-to-day -day operational tasks. This is not possible. That's why another consultant of Chief Finance helped us with functional analysis and even helped us at a certain moment in time to process operational invoices. 
Another important element, training. Don't underestimate to train the end users, super users, your business users. The training was done by Vlerik itself because we really knew the audience that was sitting in the classroom. But refinance consultants helped us to make the PowerPoints and to make hands-on um, exercises with them. And communication is also a very important element during the project, after the project. Communicate why you do the project, why it's good for the business, why you take a certain decision and how the end user will benefit out of it. Now, being two, three years later, I really see the benefits of having that design implemented. So they, yeah, I had to believe them actually, but they convinced me and it's, yeah, it's, it's, it was okay. It really helped the school and now at this moment we really see that if reporting requirements change, I can easily adapt the financial reports uh, towards that uh, new changing reporting needs. So at this moment we report on campus, on clients, participants, customers, on products, on um, courses, on portfolio, all yeah on every dimension that we would like to report on.